what's up everybody how y'all doing today you know what i'm saying hope y'all take a kid y'all accept the day you know what i'm saying y'all know what to do my good peoples you know what i'm saying like share and comment baby and smash that dope bell for me baby you heard me and keep god first baby over everything so on this note my good people i'm gonna let this video take off I'm playing a little bit, catch up at the end, baby. Let's go. It's found Lyric and Bacchus and her seven year old son, know. Deuce, dead in the garage Y'all last know week. I'm still under the Home weather, surveillance so cameras you know. captured the chaos. Deuce was a first grader in Seagaville. <sighs> Bacchus was a social heard. media influencer. Captured the chaos. Deuce was a first grader in Seagaville. Bacchus was a social media influencer. She had a clothing boutique and tens of thousands of followers. Family believes the pair died from carbon monoxide poisoning. Police are waiting on autopsies. Before where detectives are investigating the death of a mother and her little boy. Seagaville police were called to a welfare check last week when relatives couldn't get in contact with them and officers found the mother and son both unresponsive inside their home. Janelle Ford just spoke with some of their neighbors and joins us live in Seagaville with what she's learned. This here don't sound right. Well, Chris and people. Izzy, overall, this is just a very sad situation. The neighbors tell me that the mother and son were found dead in the garage of this home. You can see where someone's come and placed flowers out front. And tonight, investigators are working to learn exactly what happened. First, you hear the screams. Then moments later, you see the first responders. They're heading two doors down to this home where 27-year-old Lyric Bacchus and her seven-year-old son Deuce were found dead in the garage. It was just mayhem. Everybody out here crying, screaming. The cops were out here, they taped it off. Bacchus's family believes the pair died from carbon monoxide poisoning. Police are waiting on autopsies before confirming. This was the most people I've ever seen out here at once. Dion Loggins' home surveillance cameras captured the chaos Friday morning. He'd just gotten back from his morning run. Yeah, I was concerned about the little boy, like, is, is he at school? Like, cause I know him and my daughter go to school right here. Deuce was a first grader at Seagullville North Elementary. Monday, the school sent this letter home to parents, saying in part, we extend our love and sympathy to their family at this time and that they will have counselors on campus to help students and staff cope. What a little boy at, I was like, oh, he, the once I heard he was gone, that's what it hit me the most. I was like, oh, wow, like, he was just out here playing with my son what, about a, a week ago. Now Loggins is trying to figure out how to give his little boy the news. It's just hard for me to have a three-year-old son and have to tell him how he lost his first, his first friend. Topsies before confirming. This was the most people I've ever seen out here at once. Dion Loggins' home surveillance cameras captured the chaos Friday morning. He'd just gotten back from his morning run. Yeah, I was concerned about the little boy. Like, is, is he at school? Like, cause I know him and my daughter go to school right here. Deuce was a first grader at Seagullville North Elementary. Monday, the school sent this letter home to parents, saying in part, we extend our love and sympathy to their family at this time and that they will have counselors on campus to help students and staff cope. What a little boy at, I was like, oh, he, the once I heard he was gone, that's what it hit me the most. I was like, oh, wow, like, he was just out here playing with my son what, about a, a week ago. Now Loggins is trying to figure out how to give his little boy the news. It's just hard for me to have a three-year-old son and have to tell him how he lost his first his first friend. Friday was Lyric's uh, birthday. You know she was saying? a social media influencer. Uh, let me uh, break it down to y'all the best way I can. You feel me? I'm still, you know, fighting with that. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, uh, they say that I had looked at something else. And they say she claims she went to a little club or something. And she went and picked up her jet. When she went and picked up her jet, right, say she was uh, intoxicated, you feel me? That's what some of the other new people talking about, you feel me? But they ain't never released the autopsy, you feel what I'm saying? They need to release the autopsy, you feel me? Because they say she rolled up in there, she let the garage down because she was, you know what I'm saying, wasted. And they think she slept in the car, her and her jet. You feel me? So if she pulled up in there and she had her car on and lit down the garage and the AC was kicking, you feel me? You ain't gonna catch that that uh peroxide like you know what I'm saying? You you really ain't gonna catch that like that. Unless she had the windows down. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? I don't care if she had the windows up. 
right? Ain't no way that fumes gonna get enough. You know what I'm saying? Cause if she have a, if she had a, a brand new car like a 2023, 24, whatever, right? Them cars airtight. So she had the car on. You feel me? I don't know if she had the heat blowing on in there because it was cold. Maybe it was cold that morning. I don't know, but that's the only way it can get in there if you got the heat going. Now, if you got the AC going, you feel me? That stuff can't come in there. Only way that stuff can come in there when you got the heat. Because see, the heat, you know what I'm saying? It pushed more heat in there. You know what I'm saying? And the heat sometimes, it have more seeking holes like come through car you know what i'm saying y'all ever know when you driving sometime and you can smell somebody else car coming in your car when you got your heat on that's how that when you got the ac on it's barely it's gonna get in there at all so you know what i'm saying it's kind of hard for me to believe that she she you know what i'm saying she did that you know what i'm saying but ain't no telling she was toxic so i don't know you know what i'm saying uh this year i just can't believe this still you feel me you know what I'm saying? So, something else got to be done wrong. You know what I'm saying? Unless, you know, I'm going to say this shit. I don't want nobody to give the fence to us. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? It be the prettiest, prettiest girls, the one have the, uh, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, uh, when people feel like they can't make it. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? It, uh, I can't think of the name more at the top of my head because I'm so full of this uh what you call it and I can't think right now. Cause what I got is just, you know what I'm saying, making my mind that <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But you know when people have uh 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 not low self esteem, you know how they when people uh don't wanna live no more. You know what I'm saying? Y'all y'all get it. my head just ain't wrapped too tight right now. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. But you know what I'm saying? I don't know if she was on that type of time. Uh, she was taking medicine. Uh, wasn't nothing wrong with her at all. You feel what I'm saying? But, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I It's just hard for me to wrap my head around that she pulled up and that she would toss. I'm quite sure she don't did that too many times. So she don't did that too many times. I'm quite sure she drove all the way home and she would toss and she made it to the spot. You feel me? It's kind of hard for me to believe that. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, my good people, y'all come and let me know how y'all feel about the situation. Y'all think it was foul play? Or y'all think she was intoxicated? You know what I'm saying? Went in there and pulled up with her son. Then she dozed off in the car. I'm quite sure that little boy would have woke her up. You know what I'm saying? Mama, mama, get up. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm quite sure he'd have pushed her. Mom, we had to go in the house. And she just got to win the house. So some, some. Stop what I'm saying. Some, so you know, kids, kids will nag you to death till you get up. Unless you real intoxicated. And you don't already on side in the car, you don't fell asleep on the phone or something like that. Yeah. I don't know, man. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, my good people, you know what I'm saying? Y'all just, you know, come and let me know how y'all feel about this situation. You feel me? This is a sad situation. You feel me? I, if I put their pictures up there, you know what I'm saying? Uh I don't want to do it, but I might. I don't know. But anyway, my good people, you know, hey, this the end. I'm going to scratch that. That's all I got for y'all. You know what I'm saying, my good peoples? But y'all know what to do. You know what I'm saying? Like, share, and comment, baby. Smack that doorbell for me, baby. You heard me? And keep God first, baby, over everything. So on this note, my good people, I'm gone from y'all, baby. I'm gone. <laughs>